Hello and Happy New Year um, from Right Riches for You. I'm Lale. Hi, I'm Lale Hancock, and I have the magnificent Curry Glycel with me here today. I'm, I'm glad you said magnificent as opposed to malevolent. <laughs> for some reason, I like magnificent better. I, I'll take magnificent. Thank you. Well, we're starting off a new year. And Curry, you know, come the new year, there's all, all sorts of different resolutions or targets that people are making for truly what they'd like to create in 2017. So as we get started, I'd love it if you could maybe share a little bit about what is Right Riches for you? Well, thank you, Ale. Actually, it's really easy because the very first word is right. The second word is riches, and then three and four is for you. Okay, so let's let's go let's go a little rewind here. Right, riches for you. So, what is your requirement for riches now and for the future? What does each individual require? The magnificent thing about these classes are that they are individualized. Every single person can get what they require out of them. Whether you have $100 in the bank and you just scraped it together to be on the telecall, or you can't even be on the telecall, or you have boo-coo, boo-coo, and you just like to have more boo-coo. So <laughs> really and truly, you know, it's for everyone. I've been up and down with finances a lot in my life, so... It's really great to invite people from all walks of life to figure out, find out, and have, have it possible to find out what works for them. Yes. So I had this really brilliant thought just a second ago, and it went, Bloop. okay, it'll come back. So right riches for you would be different than what right riches for me is, you know. Um, oh, no, I just remembered. So I'm going to talk about this amazing lady and apparently she took what I said to heart. There was a woman who was struggling and she lived in the UK. And apparently, I found out this a lot later, she had been listening to my free telecalls. I do a free telecall, I think every other month now or something. It's called Creating Something From Nothing. And she told me this when we met at one of Dane's Being You classes, okay? In Paris, I think it was. And she said, she came up to me and she was like super drama. And I'm like, oh my gosh, okay, what's happening now? And she's like, I have to say thank you to you. And I went, you're welcome. For what? And she goes, because months and months ago, I didn't have hardly any money. And I so couldn't figure out how to create money. And I was listening to your free telecall. And you gave me specific instructions and processes. And you encouraged me to start running bars. If you don't know what bars are, it's this amazing process that is, I would call it magical stress release. That's the easiest way to put it. And you touch the head, and it's light touch, and it's miraculous. And you can do it for an hour to an hour and a half on anyone, and you can charge them at least a dollar a minute. So to get her confidence up, she started charging people $60 for bars classes. And this was six oh. to eight, nine months ago. Oh. She was then at Dane's class, which is what, a couple of grand to go to for four days. And she goes, all the classes I've taken are because you encouraged me to just go ahead and start where I could, charge what I felt comfortable with, and just begin. Just start. Just start. And I was like, whoa, that is so cool. That is, for me, a true story about what the class Right Riches for You can do for you. It will encourage you to start where you are and head towards the future. I love that story. I, I hope that works for you guys. But it's a beautiful story about someone who didn't have a lot of money. She couldn't even afford to take, like, my specialty. Sometimes I give specials for, like, $79 for telecalls. She couldn't even afford that at this point. She could only be on the free telecalls. And now she's sending herself to classes. Mm. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. And if she's sending herself to classes, that means she's also adding other things into her life too. 
And that's the piece that we won't really maybe know until she shares more information. But that's what it is, is constantly adding to your life. Courage. She had courage. She went, okay, I don't know if I'm good. I don't know if people will receive me. I'm just going to start. And she just started and had the courage to start. And you know, one thing about it, Curry, is whenever you and I talk about Right Riches or your classes that you have coming up, you know, it's, it's funny, like you always even bring me to a place of like re reminding me of like all the gifts that we actually have that we take for granted. And, you know, it's not until like someone else sometimes, you know, you know highlights it in us that we remember. So with Right Riches, you know, are there certain tools, are there certain questions that are some of your favorites that you can share with people who are watching this today? Absolutely. It's all right if we sort of start at the very beginning. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So like my favorite question to start off a, a class and I teach beginners. I teach the very intro intro. Like you can come to my intro without even having bars. Okay. So I ask people, so money, what does money mean to you? And I sit back for a few minutes. Oh my gosh. Just think about that. What does money mean to you? <sighs> and then people begin to share what it means to them. And it's the meanings that we need to get through and be willing to destroy and uncreate what we have made meaningful about money, whether it's bad, awful, terrible, or whether it's fabulous, amazing, whether it's out of reach or whether it's like taboo or secret. So there's so many meanings we've attached to money. What if money actually didn't have a meaning and it was as easy as breathe in, breathe out. What if you could breathe in money? Yes. <laughs> right? I mean, just it, it sort of blows your mind. It's sort of a what, 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 breathe, money, what? So what if it was a totally different point of view that you could have about money and it wasn't significant and it wasn't dangerous and it wasn't secretive and it wasn't oh, responsible and it wasn't all these you know all these things right that we assign these meanings we assign to money that's where I start with people what does money mean to you what else curry I want more <laughs> Well, the first thing I think about is like, so where'd you grow up, Lale? Where were you raised? For me, I actually was born in Iran. Oh, and, really? yeah. During, during a coup or not during a coup? Well, actually, before the coup and during the coup, I left the country. <laughs> smart. <laughs> actually, so, my dad was very smart. We left when I was seven. Yeah. Okay. So does your dad have a point of view or two about money and what money means to him he did he did he had a lot of points of view about money and he was a great creator and a great destructor at the same time yeah so this is really interesting because here now you're going a little bit more advanced because we start with okay so what is our point of view about money so is it even your point of view or is it maybe your father's, maybe your mother's, maybe your culture's? So we really start at the beginning. Where did we buy these points of view as true? Are they true? Yeah. If it's right, it's right for you. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Where do we buy these points of view? How many points of view have we bought that are not true for us right now? And we're still functioning from them because we just sort of take it for granted. Well, yeah. Um, well, so one of the ones I took for granted was a kind of churchy because I was raised Episcopalian Catholic light. I was raised that money was the root of all evil, mm -hmm. but actually not. I mean, that's not really true. That's just a belief system. Is money dirty? Is money filthy? Why do we call it filthy lucre? Mm -hmm. so we just look at some of these things and, and what have we grown up around? So there's where we start. And if you are the destroyer and the creator of your entire life, it also means you're the creator and the destroyer of your financial present, past, and 
hopefully a different future. The good news about being a creator is that you can change your mind. If you're willing to be courageous and honest with yourself and stop lying to yourself. And actually, this is another thing we get into in the very beginning classes. Where have you lied to yourself? Where are you lying to yourself? If you're willing to go, oh, man, I did this thing. I, did, I created this. And once you acknowledge it, mostly it's, it's more than likely it's going to be very brilliant, even though it didn't have the side effect you really were looking for. <laughs> so if you can acknowledge where you're at, then you have a different choice. Just, you know, once you acknowledge, you have a different choice. Again, these are super basic and super important and super valuable. And I still use those same tools today and I've used them today and this morning. Um, I would even say I would start with the access mantra. All of life comes to me with ease, joy, and glory. I listened to that all last night because all of my life comes to me with ease, joy, and glory. That's my financial life. That's my emotional life. That's my family life. That's my travel life. That's my work life. That's my everything, my relationship life. All of life, the good, the bad, and the ugly can come with ease. And like, uh, so all of your financial life can come with ease, joy, and glory. Whoa, what does that mean? You can use the mantra to encourage your financial life. Yeah. Yes. And how does it get any better than that? Yes. You know, every time you do something or you create something, no matter how small it is, if you make $5 more than you did yesterday, acknowledge that's $5 more than yesterday. Cool. And how does it get better than that? If you find $20 on the street, wow, how does it get better than that? These tools actually work to create a different future. Yeah, they really do. And I love it. It doesn't matter how long, you know, uh, how long I've been using those tools. It's like every day is a new day with these tools. It just opens a whole new world than it did even 10 seconds earlier or a day earlier or a year earlier or whatever. It's just every day is a new day with these tools. I love it. It is. And if you're feeling a little bit wonky, like everything's just not going great, I have a suggestion. Put on a hat. That's funny. <laughs> oh, I don't have a hat. Oh. <laughs> put on a hat. Go get a funny hat. If you're feeling funky, put on something fabulous and hilarious and laugh at yourself because 10 seconds, you can change your situation. You can change your mood. If you have 10 seconds to live your life, what do you choose, right? Okay. Put on, put on something happy, you know, I love this. We, you know, it's been, we've been New Year's in New York and look at these crazy glasses. Wah, 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 wah. Oh, look, look, they go blink, blink. Look, blink, ah, you can like psychedelic yourself out. It's pretty funny, right? <laughs> you know, laugh, laugh at yourself. Be grateful for what you've done. Be grateful for the crazy stuff you've done. Do not stay in judgment. That is a super big tool, particularly for creating your financial future. Do not stay in the judgment of the mess you've made. All right, you made a mess. Cool, great, 10 seconds. I'll give you 10 seconds to stay in judgment, and then it's time to get out and create, create. What else can you create now? That wasn't working. Now, what can you create? What can you add to your life today to generate a richer future right away? Oh, I like that. So Curry, you've got some fun classes that are coming up all around the world, oh literally gosh. around the world. I do, I do. <laughs> super fun, super fun. And in these really cool places too. I'm so excited I get to go. Yeah. You've got something coming up the end of January. It's a telecall, so anyone can join you around the world on the 28th of January. That's true. And the thing that's cool about the telecalls is that I really take time with people when they have their own stuff. You can really speak about what your individual issue. I will hand you a tissue for your issue with money. <laughs> And most of the people have found that their issues aren't, first of all, they're not even their issues. 
They belong to somebody else and they bought them as true and real. It's, it's, a, it's spectacular to take a class where you can only talk about money if you like. If you'd like to talk about other things, we can too. And I always try and bring it back to, well, okay, so financially speaking, how did this affect you? Or how would you like it to affect you? I always try to bring it back to the financial aspect. <clears throat> and, and that's another thing about these classes. We do one, two, three days of money, talking about money. Oh my gosh, can you imagine talking for three days about money and your money stuff? It's pretty cool. I do suggest that you guys read Money's Not the Issue You Are is extremely helpful. <laughs> can lay a foundation for even getting more out of the classes. But you don't have to. It's just, uh, I would highly recommend that book. And the Right Riches for You book as well, you know. It's yeah. just, they're amazing books. Yeah. Actually, I have I have them highlighted. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> There's so many. Like even like sometimes I just like to just like open it. It doesn't matter to what, and it's exactly what I required at that moment to facilitate yeah. myself um, to ask a question. You know, maybe to get me out of whatever it is I was actually you know trying to stick myself in. Um, and uh, yeah, what else, Curry? You've got a telecall, you've got, you're going to be in London in February. Well, the t yeah, but the telecall, the, actually it's the, it's the first class, it's the Right Riches 101, which is called Fundamentals of Wealth. It actually starts on January 28th. And that's a prerequisite to coming to the two day, like Right Riches View 102. And I do have both of those in London on the 24th, 25th, 26th of February. And then we do repeat performance in Denver, Colorado, mid-March, I think 10, 11, 12. And then we go to India. I'm super excited. We go to India the first weekend, uh, 789, something like that. Guess what, everybody? This is the first year, but we're adding Right Riches for You facilitators. I know, right? Yay, I'm, so I'm excited. People helping me. Let's just cover the world with Right Riches for You facilitators. And, and really, how amazing to have a facilitator in every country, every city in the world, asking the question, what does money mean to you? What do you love about money? What do you hate about money? Do you love spending money or do you love having money? We have tools that assist you in having money. Now, if you only love spending money, it's going to be a little hard to have money. It's kind of logical there on that respect. <laughs> And the facilitator is actually also with Mr. Gary Douglas. Oh, heck yeah. <laughs> so the party for the facilitators for Right Riches starts in May, and it's May 28th and, uh, in Houston. So I'm really excited about that. But also, you know, what I love about it is, Curry, you have so many tools, resources that are out there. You've got audio. You are on the Access TV there's so many places people can, you know, really find tools and resources and, and, and get a hold of you and have a session with you. So it's really true. And right now I'm having a special in January and February. The, I call them the wham, bam, thank you, ma'am sessions. <laughs> three, three sessions, 30 minutes each for $300. So how does it get even better? How does it? It's really fun because, and like within three to five days of each other, so we go bam, 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 and we address a particular situation. And people seem to like them. And I like them because I don't get bored doing them. <laughs> They're just like, bam, let's go. Bam, let's go. And then I just fry your ass, and we have a lot of fun. <laughs> <laughs> and then you come for more. <laughs> if, you, if you desire more, you, there's always more. Absolutely. Absolutely. And there's lots of different ways people can find you. There's the right riches for you.com, which brings you back to the classes that you have on the access site until the new access website launches. I know. So and Facebook. Got, yes, Facebook. we have Facebook. We have right riches for you with Curry Glycel. We have lots of different resources that are available. So yeah. as we're wrapping this up, Curry, any last words, anything you'd like to share with everybody? Oh my gosh. I would say take courage. You're only one point of view away 
from a new and different financial reality. Just one point of view can change your whole reality and you can change it like that. That's the magic of access consciousness and the magic of the right riches for you tools and glasses. Thank you, Curry. You're awesome. You're Look welcome. Forward to seeing you in person really soon. Thank you, Ale. Love chatting with you. Happy, happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year, everyone. Bye-bye. Bye. Whoa, whoa.